If you want to speed up your converting process, then what you can actually do is utilize GPU encoding. But when you use GPU encoding, what you need to realize is that the compression may not be very efficient. So the file size may be high, but the conversion will be very fast. So to actually go ahead and utilize it, let me just go ahead and load up a file. Let's say, for example, this file right here. So now you can see that I can choose MP4 format and web optimized right here. And in order for you to utilize GPU for its uh, processing, you can go around over here onto video. And here you can see that the video encoder is set to X264. So the X264, X265 right here, just like this, are CPU based um, um, uh, renderers right here. But over here you can see that NVIDIA NVENC is an option and that is actually a GPU rendering option that you can choose. So, so now once you go ahead and select this, it'll use the GPU to render that out. Similarly, if I were to go around over here onto MKV right here, just like this in video, then you can see that you have an option uh, for the same as well, just like this. And then if I were to go around onto WebM, however, you don't see those options. So depending on the video format, you may get an option right here. If you have AMD or Intel based uh, GPUs, then you would see those options around over here as well. So once you go ahead and choose this, the encoding process as you start will be much more faster right here, just like this. And that is how you can utilize GPU encoding as necessary inside of Handbrake. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.